hi guys welcome to another video today is going to be a workout for you guys finally i feel like i've been promising workout videos for a really long time but like i said i don't have a workout partner i usually just go to the gym by myself robert is still not like 100 percent going to the gym like every single day consistently so the days that he does go there it's just like a really quick workout so i don't always have somebody there to film me and i like getting good footage i don't want to just like put my camera down on the floor get a weird angle for you guys so today i have a workout partner i'm working out with my friend carla from high school she is a figure competitor i think she's actually trying to go into physique now so i don't know we haven't talked in a while we just kind of message each other on um instagram like hey let's get a workout in so I'm very excited. Um, I feel like her specialty is definitely upper body and mine is lower body for sure. So <laughs> I'm excited to get a workout in. I really, really wanna focus on growing my upper body, my back, my biceps, my arms, my shoulders, everything. So it's gonna be a great workout, I know it. So let's go ahead and get into the workout. Alrighty guys, I'm doing my first ever voiceover. I wanted to take you guys through this entire workout and give you some tips and cues as to what we did. So we started off with a superset and actually the entire workout is going to be consisting of supersets focusing mainly on back width and middle back thickness. So this first superset we're going to be doing 10 reps, 4 sets. Um, in the pull down machine first a wide grip facing forward normal and then you're going to go ahead and turn around and do 10 reps um facing your back your back is going to be facing the machine so some tips when training back is that you always want to focus on pulling down with your elbows so one thing that i do when doing a pull pull down motion or row or whatever i do on back day is i try not to use my thumbs at all and i try to just have my hands be there as like little hooks and i'm really focusing on driving with my elbows so four sets of 10 reps in this first superset and then we're going to go ahead and jump in to our second superset which is a um straight arm pull down this is Carla performing the first set and she's doing 10 reps wide grip and then 10 reps in an inside grip to be able to hit the middle back. We didn't record this but we also did an active rest in between sets where we did um, burpees. So 12 to 15 reps of burpees in between sets just to get our heart rate up. I have problems sweating when it's not leg day and I really like sweating during my workouts because it makes me feel like I'm actually working. Um, I achieved a pump by this time. It was very, very difficult. All these supersets were murdering my back and then jumping right into burpees was like the icing on the cake. I absolutely love this workout, you guys. I want you guys to go ahead and try it out. I'm gonna leave it in the description box below, as I said. And just finishing up here, this is the first time that I see my back, cause I don't really see my back, and wows. I be working in the gym, you guys. <laughs> Alrighty, next superset. We're gonna be doing a cable row with two different attachments so this first attachment we're going to be using a wide grip and that's again for back width and you see Carla here she has perfect form she is not arching her back um, she's keeping everything nice and tight leaning forward just to get a little bit better range of motion and then pulling back driving with her elbows as always and then we're going to superset with a close grip row to hit again the middle of your back and for these she's leaning all the way forward again to get a better range of motion and then keeping those lats contracted so that you focus on hitting your middle back only so now it's my turn and <laughs> i feel like i look so tiny compared to carla like her physique is so badass i know that she's gonna do awesome in her debut of physique here in three weeks um but yeah so just really focus on driving with your elbows you guys and you see how i'm barely using my thumbs that's what i do for most of my back movements and i've noticed worlds of a difference when 
really focusing on that mind muscle connection only trying to pull the weight with my back and not my arms i used to do that a lot where i would feel it so much in my arms and i would think that i would was doing my back too you know but i was not getting sore i was not growing i was not progressing in those areas so now we're moving on to our final superset of our back workout and this is just a regular row focusing on the rhomboids and we're going to do 10 reps 10 reps i'm sorry 10 reps with an underhand grip and then you're going to move on to a cable rowing machine or you can also just get a dumbbell if your machine if your gym doesn't have this machine you can get a dumbbell and row row your boat <laughs> i wasn't going to say that but that's catchy so 10 reps four sets on both of these actually all of our workout was 10 reps four sets now we're moving on to the last um, bit of this workout and it's a tri set to really finish off your biceps so when you train back and biceps on the same day you don't necessarily have to go and do 50 million exercises for biceps because your biceps are already working when training back. It is a secondary muscle, so they don't need to be hit um, as hard as your back. So this tricep included a reverse curl, 10 reps, superset with a regular barbell curl, 10 reps, supersetted with cross body hammer curls, 10 reps. This absolutely murdered my biceps and I'm already feeling it right now just hours after the workout. I know I'm going to be sore. My arms are like one of my biggest um, insecurities I would say. I wish they were leaner but we'll get to it and that's the end of the workout. Hope you guys enjoyed that workout. She kicked my ass to say the least. I'm going to be sore. I already know it. My back is so pumped. My biceps. Look, look at that. I always had a little bicep even though I don't really train them that often that's a lie I train them all the time but I don't like necessarily go so hard and I always had a bicep peak I don't know if that's from my gymnast days but anyways I hope that you guys enjoyed that workout she kicked my ass she's three weeks away from her competition she's competing in physique for her first time I know she's gonna do great you guys saw she's shredded she's looking really good so we already planned to do legs hamstring and glute focus on Thursday and I'm gonna probably film that for you guys too. I told you guys I was gonna get workouts up for you guys. See, I'm not a liar. I do as promised. So if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. I'm gonna leave Carla's Instagram down in the description box below, as well as the entire workout so you can screenshot it and take it with you to the gym. So that's gonna be it for this video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. It helps out my channel a lot. And don't forget to click that subscribe button down below. If you're already here, might as well. Love you guys. See you in the next one. Peace.